Okay, I've had a lot of people asking me how to build the hidden blade that I made. Um, they're all asking me, post a tutorial, make a tutorial. Lots of tutorials and all that. Um, and I'm tired of it, so I'm going to make one for you guys and try to videotape the process, every little piece. Um, it's a... Uh, you know, the double action kinda it's not automatic, there's a little bit of a you have to throw your arm out like that to get it to extend which isn't much of a hassle but you know I think it's better than single one way out and then having to manually retract it or um, you know all the other ways people have made them so, let's get to work. First, let's go through parts. Um, I got these drawer slides at Home Depot. They're uh, Liberty Hardware. Uh, I don't know if you can see that exactly. I just left the packaging on so there's no smoke and mirrors. So it's already open. Next, you're going to need springs. Um, these guys, you want to get the extension spring that are, uh, oh, oh, hold on there. It's that size, and I believe it is the bottom one that you uh, want to use. The top one's kind of a, actually, it might be the, I don't know. You want to use the big one. Um, it's this guy, and it's really a light spring. And it's it's on the back there. You can see whoop, right there, and that uh, it's kick-ass spring. Okay, normally I buy the little packages of screws and, and or nuts and bolts, but today I went ahead and bought the big old boxes because I'm planning to make a bunch of these for sale. If you guys want to, you're interested in buying them. If you uh, can't build one yourself. Um, but yeah, they're these uh, 832 by one and a half inch and the 832 nuts to go with them. Okay, so for this piece back here that stops the blade, um, technically it's kind of, uh, sorry, it's unnecessary. Um, you could just do a bolt that goes straight up that holds this and, and go, but that would just be too lame and the, and this gives you a little like a centimeter more blade length you know which could be crucial I don't know but uh, it's this little guy right here and I made this one for another blade that I was making out of this stuff it's a square tubing and I'll show you how to make one of those later. But, um, yeah, you can get that Home Depot as well. Alright, and now a big part of my blade is actually this saw blade. Um, you want this material because it can bend whoo, like this. Ugh, and then it'll go right back to straight. Um, it's kind of neat. Uh, and that's what I make the ever crucial little locking mechanism out of this little guy um, okay next we'll do uh, tools that you need I'm gonna clear this off we'll be right back. okay so first um, the most important tool in my arsenal is this uh, disc grinder um, I don't know where we got this. We've had it for a long time. I use it on like all my projects. It, uh, I call it a lightsaber because I'm a dork. But it, it cuts through everything and anything except glass, which I don't care because I don't play with glass. It hurts. Um, this is handy. It's a little file, metal file. Uh, just for those little odd little 
small parts. Um, you might want one of these. It's a hacksaw, metal hacksaw. I might use that for some stuff. Um, big tools. I'm going to pick you up. And we're going to look over here. Yeah, my garage is a mess. Um, shut up. A bent or a drill press. One of these dealies. That's uh, really handy. I didn't have one when I built the other guy, but um, they're super handy. I, I have it now. Whoa, I almost fell. Too much shit in my garage. And a bench grinder. Um, <laughs> mine's kind of broken. Uh, missing some of the safety features, but that's all right. My my wheel's kind of round. You'll be able to see that. It's a uh, piece, but hey, it works and um, stuff. I have a brush side and I have a grindy side. Um, oh, and another thing that's really nice to have is one of these. A vise. I didn't have one of these while I was building that guy either. I used uh, C-clamps in my bench. But, uh, these are so nice to have. It makes everything so much easier. Um, yeah, so let's get to building this thing. Uh, 